morning, everybody. First and foremost, giving honor to God and to my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Without their grace and mercy, I wouldn't be be able to, I guess, come across these Facebook Live airwaves. So that's, that has to be done always. Uh, secondly, I want to, uh, it's December 1st, everybody. Can you believe it? Wow. Did 2016 just, me and my wife were talking about it last night. Did 2016 just fly by like it was nothing? Woo! All right, let's get to the topic at hand. Well, if you didn't check out Obama's press secretary, Josh Ernest, a.k.a. Josh Dishonest, his uh, briefing with the press yesterday, and he talked about the deal that President-elect Trump made was carrier, keeping those jobs in Indiana. And if you ha didn't happen to go see it or hear it, I suggest you do. And I'm going to give you my couple minutes summation in regards to what went down. Okay, so he made a statement, and I'm just paraphrasing here. Someone asked him about it. Some unknown reporter, really. It was like not, not someone that we normally know. Just some, some Yahoo in the back brought up the uh, scenario of, 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 excuse me, of Trump and Carrier and saving these jobs. Well, he kind of fluffed it over real quick and was like, well, you know, you know, it's good that it happened. It's good that he's keeping jobs in here. But, and then the rest of his summation on it was him salivating over his boss once again, talking about he needs to do that like 800 and something more times like Obama did, which we yeah, right, really? And how he rescued, rescued the auto industry. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, okay. You, we all know what went down with that bailout, with that takeover, with that Obama going to the shareholders and, and, and CEOs and, and, and everyone else at those auto industries, telling them what they had to do in order for them to get this bailout, basically hanging everything over their heads in order for them to get this bailout. It wasn't a rescue, it was a takeover. So for Josh Dishonest to keep bringing up the auto industry, for the left, the liberals, and the Democrat party in this country to continue to bring up Obama rescuing the auto industry, ladies and gentlemen, how many more months we got left? We got a month and about a half. We got a month and a half. It's December 1st, 2016. We have a month and a half before the most tyrannical presidential regime is shoved out the door. So ladies and gentlemen, don't get it twisted. We'll find out the details in regards to this carrier Trump deal, keeping these jobs in the country. And of course the left is going to pound it they're going to they're going to discredit it. They're going to criticize it. They're going to do everything in their power to make it look like Trump did absolutely nothing. But yet he's doing something before he's even sworn in, keeping jobs here in America, which he promised he would do. So ladies and gentlemen, before I sign off, please don't please don't get it twisted. The fact that Trump did this before he was even sworn in, goes to show, goes to show that the past eight years of Josh Dishonest going up, speaking to us like we are completely ignorant to the fact that Obama has done nothing in regards to the economy and in regards to jobs, don't get it twisted. Peace.